standing there naked with only a helmet on. That's not how you rock. That's how <laughs> no. I go out every day. <laughs> Look at my wife after getting up, put on a hat, and go, Peace. <laughs> bitching how we do. Yeah. I like that it's supposed to be like a Venusian style planet. Mm hmm. This armor suits you, but it cannot hide that mark. Nothing ever will. You are the arbiter, the will of the prophets. But these are my elites. Their lives matter to me, yours does not. That makes two of us. Uh, it looks like it already is. So in Halo Infinite, because mm -hmm. it's supposed to be like a soft reboot, but it's after Halo 5 gameplay. I think so. Okay. I wasn't sure if it gave you like a like why the the brutes are being assholes again. No, and elites like, join them. It's it's yeah, like you said. It's so, like I remember, it was just like you fought all of them: brutes, jackals, yeah, grunts, and elites. But oh, as far as bars. I thought, like there was like some sort of schism between the brutes and the. I think that gets covered in Halo Four. Okay. Oh, or, well, the uh, schism between the brutes and the elites happens in here. Oh. Nope. 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 Why would? Oh, did you fall? I did. What happened? Oh, no. Um. Oh, shit. I have active camo. Yeah, how'd you do it? Um, the same I used up on the D-pad. How it opens. Who the fuck? Oh, you were in front of me, <laughs> and I. Oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I am so sorry. No, it's fine. I was like, what happened? I lunged, and then I was like, how did he? How did you're like, what the fuck? And I'm like, how did how did that guy in front of me not die? <laughs> oh, it feels so good to be running around with a sword. Yeah. And after going from like Halo Halo One, where there just isn't one. Uh, and mm -hmm. then, honestly, even, like, let's just talk uh, Army of Two, like, the melee just wasn't good. Was bad, yeah. Um, so, like, having a solid melee, this feels like a good... Oh, no. What? I keep forgetting that everything breaks. Uh-huh. Mm, I ate shit. Again? I think they have carbines. Really? Yeah. Where are they? Uh, the, the, that's what the the enemy's carrying are carbines. Oh yeah, I see that now. And it it really tells you like, hey, use your. I'm blown up. <sighs> yes. Oh shit! Yeah, it is. Yeah, I love I love the upgraded look to it too. Uh, what is a not? I, don't know, I guess I can oh, it there you go. Like oh, it, it yeah. tells you how much is on it. Huh. I wish it told you more was on on this one. I I like the fact that it's like here's your like it. it I don't know. I I wish it told you a little bit more about the ammo with it. Mm hmm.
Where are you at? Where are you at? I'm like at the elevator where we're supposed to be with our team. Oh. I'll probably find you. Oh, I found you. Oh, wait, yeah. no, you're down there? Yeah. Oh, wait, we're all supposed to be down there? Yeah, we're all going down here. Oh. I think this is the... Fuck! Oopsie. <laughs> <laughs> I think this is this is probably the the point of the game that I I decided like I didn't like Halo Two uh, was because I was like why am I playing as the Arbiter Oh yeah Where's Master Chief Yeah I want to play as Master Chief yeah. and, and I'm just and, and guys I I want you to picture it in that uh, slimy way Oh this is also the game <laughs> where you got dual wielding needlers mm -hmm. um and they were broken How So, so you do double the damage oh. and the damage ramps up faster. It's, oh. it's really like your, your, uh, DPS is just something so, gotcha. and that's why they took it away in, in the third, in the, in the, uh, mm. third game because it just, yeah, i like, we will rinse. So who are we fighting now? We are fighting a, uh, a schism. Oh, so okay. this is, the the whole point of this here is that the right so the the elites lost. Oh yeah, I was. That's why I've not been executed yet because yes. I've been sent to go. Okay. So now you're going to go here, and theoretically, what your job here is to kill uh, the heretic elites that are uh, that are like trying to cause a rift in the covenant. Gotcha. Uh, the reason that it's so big and why it's like such a, a huge thing that the arbiter is doing it is because the one it's it's like hey here's the greatest honor to go silence your own kind mm -hmm. uh typically when the arbiters are used is when people aren't falling in line to the covenant uh but when the yeah. brutes came along they were like well the brutes are stronger uh they're more loyal and they're like more ruthless like they'll actually betray each other uh, uh so and because the elites were starting to question like where are we at? What are we doing? You know, yeah, why? What is, what, what is this fight? Why are we yeah. all dying? Is this religion real? Uh, the last guy is, I think, supposed to be a, a survivor of the. The ship's got a cool design. I thought so too. Yeah. Ew. <laughs> Looks definitely better. It feels like a, you can rock it if we're standing on the side of it. Oh really? Yeah. Like, watch me jump and land. And the ship's like, hmm. like, floating down a little bit heavier there. Okay. Um. Oh. Now we gotta open the hangar doors. I love the hexagon, like aiming for it. Oh. Yeah. Oh, just so much is just enjoyable about this weapon. Mm-hmm. Oh, are these sentinels? No, they're not sentinels because it's not a. As far as I know, this is not a forerunner facility. Oh, uh, okay. Fuel rod cannons. We got. Yeah, you can pick them up in this game. Nice. Uh, maybe... You, yes, you can. Cool. So if you want a fuel rod cannon, feel free. Oh, whoops. Oh. And I like how hard it is to figure out who you're fighting when you're running around with these elites. Mm-hmm. I've, I've just been waiting for the reticle to turn red. I'm like, all right. Oh, shit, you're not done. Oh uh, yeah, these elites have jetpacks on them, so they look like the ones we were fighting when we were outside. Yeah, but it, it's definitely very telling of if you were looking at it from like a motif Ooh, of me. like, Oops. hey, we're of of how we're deciding to tell this story. Mm -hmm. Being like, it's hard to tell who the actual enemy is, and then it's like, nah, but you're you're fighting your own kind. It's it's a really good way to go about it. Mm -hmm. Oh damn, it. I keep falling through. Ooh, yeah, you're an enemy. So I think that's actually the boss. Who? That the guy that you're fighting there, that's actually him. And he's like teleporting every time like you hit him. Oh. And he like goes invisible and like Ooh. 